Hi everyone, today I'll be showing you how to solve complicated extended fractions. So let's get right on into the topic. So here we have an extended fraction. An extended fraction is a fraction that is dividing another fraction. So here we have 1 divided by 4 over 5, which is a fraction. And a rule you want to know before solving these extended fractions is that if there is a 1 on top of another fraction, the fraction flips, meaning the numerator becomes the denominator, and the denominator becomes the numerator of the bottom fraction. So here, the 4 over 5 flips, becoming 5 over 4. And this happens because what we are actually doing is multiplying 5 over 4 on both sides. So here, the 5s and the 4s cancel out, and the 5 over 4 has nothing to cancel out here, so it just becomes 5 over 4. So let's get right on into the actual question. Here we have a complex extended fraction. It looks like this. So we have to work our way bottom to top when doing these extended fractions. So first we see three and one over three. So then we add these, um, we add these numbers and it becomes 3 and 1 over 3. Then we make this into an improper fraction, making it 10 and 10 over 3. Then, because we see there's a 1 on top, we flip this 10 over 3, making it 3 over 10. Then we have the other, the other part of 3 plus 3 tenths over 1. So here, we add the 3 and 3 tenths, making it 3 and 3 tenths. And then we make this an improper fraction. So here we make it 33 over 10. And then, since there's a 1 on top of it, we flip the fraction and we get our fraction, we get the answer of 10 over 33. So this may seem hard at first, but trust me, you'll get it. And you just need a little bit of practice and it becomes super easy. And uh, share this video with your friends. If they cannot share the, these questions and videos with your friends, if they cannot solve the question, recommend this video to them. And um, thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.